Yo, what is good, guys? I'm super glad that I caught this match. GTM versus Rory. I was just like, in 30 minutes, there should be the next game. But then I'm like, yeah, I'm checking smoke trees, and here's a game that's 30 minutes earlier. So yeah, I'm commentating this by myself. Which is, oh, you might like it, you might not like it. We will see. Um, these teams look really familiar. It's RSO you. Um, I don't sleep all night, so I hope I can concentrate fine. Like, I tried to sleep, it didn't work. I uploaded more SPL, and now I will just stay up and record more SPL because I'm fucking insane. I don't care, like, I need the content for you guys, like. <laughs> it's only a few more weeks, like, it's only three more weeks, and then it should be playoffs. So, he leads with Landers, let me look at the teams and matchup and stuff. Obviously, Mega Gardevoir on GTM's side. Healing Wish Lady to support that. Um, probably Spex Zone or AV Zone or Chopple. Like, um, Scarf Zone is not a set. Like, okay, U turns out on the tank. Growth into Gardevoir. Um, he doesn't have a good switch into this at all. We were like we will also kind of goes in on Rory stream if it has low kick for the Tita and like Keldy is the only like we will check. Like we will also doesn't have good solutions. What does we will come in on? It comes in on Tangros. What would be the Scarfer? Um, yeah, Rory has Sandra's jewel, so maybe he doesn't need a Scarfer. Ah, uh, he could be he could be Scarfland though. So that's a solve as the crit is really annoying. That crit is really annoying. Yeah, so much hex in SPL. Drill gonna take a shitload, yeah. Offensive drill with lefties. I I don't know if it's like if it just has like a little bit in bulk, but I think it's just offensive drill. Um GTM has a Lando which is his only potential rocker. Yo, watch GTM make like a super aggro play and stay in here. I mean, he has no reason to make that play, but... Yeah, okay, okay. Thankfully, he didn't make a super aggro play there. If, if, if this was ladder, I would've made a super aggro play for no reason. I would've gone mad, because the opponent would've like... <laughs> just got, gone for Iron Hand. I think there's a Gen 4 game going on. I don't know, I don't know if it's for a speed. Okay, that, that did a lot. I think that Spex Kelly, I'm not 100% sure. I haven't played Aurus in a while, and like, Spex Kelly is really common in Aurus. Scarf Tar, I assume? Scarf Tar, um, it has to be Scarf Tar to speed the Gadawa. So, yeah, I don't know what I'm trying to say here. Obviously, Scarf Tar. I'm not chirping, right? <laughs> Kelly gets a free switch, and then since he got that crit on the Tangros, that Tangros is low. We were looking really scary with the Kelly gone, like. Oh, it makes a nice play going Landers on the secret third. Watch this be non choice. Like, I assume this would be the Scarfer. Either either this is the Scarfer. He said, damn. Watch this be a bluff and he's not choice locked. Like, I'm pretty sure he is choice locked, but watch this be a bluff and he's not choice locked. Um, So, Laddie is probably like Live Orb. <laughs> you clicked that with like speed as well. But, yeah, you clicked it super fast. Okay, nice play there, getting like some chip with helmet. Medicham also doesn't have switch-ins, but that's nothing new. Yeah, this is actually... Mm. You can just ice punch here, right? Like, I guess he could go... Oh, I guess man is on. Oh my god! Rodri is wild, he high jump kicked. Like, I thought he might try to go Keldy on Ice Push, that, but then was like, what if he has Zen Hat, but there's no way you go Keldy. I didn't think he would high jump kick there. That was a wild play, but it worked. Like, like I know Magnuson gets blown away, and but I just didn't think he would high jump kick there. I mean, that was just a sag, even if he went for Ice Punch. Like, if he went for Ice Punch on the Magnuson, he could have pivoted back into Lando next turn, but it's not like that doesn't do much, because he still doesn't have switch-ins to mage him. 
So it's actually looking better for Rodri now. Since he made that aggressive play into Landris on the secret sword, and he's probably gonna go for water move this time because last time made Rodri made that aggro play. He doesn't get the burn. Ah, uh, they started an Uber's match. I don't know if that's for SPL. I don't think it is. It's. I think it's probably for Uber Seasonals. Hard Weevil on Leaf Storm. Hmm. Would you go for Loki here, predicting the teacher? Or would you go for Pursuit, bringing this to switch out? I think he just. Mm, I, I was about to say, if he's banned, that knockoff might kill, but if you're not banned, you have to click Icicle Crash, but the guy clicked the move too fast, he didn't even let me speak. <laughs> I mean, if Medicham has Bullet Punch, Medicham can come in. Otherwise, Rory doesn't really have much for this. But the thing is, it dies to um, Life Orb. It only has three hits. And if the Sandstorm is up, it only has one or two hits. Probably two hits. Um, so he's either going... I mean, he's obviously, in my opinion, Scarf Lando. Or offensive Lando, but he should be Scarf for speed control. I didn't pay attention to his Caldeo. Um, the opposing Caldeo is Hydro Pump. Oh yeah, Roddy's Caldeo was spec, so... He goes in the Tita, doubles into Landers to make it... Make the Weaver die from um, Sand and Helmet, I think. He predicted him the low kick. And GTM went for Icicle Crash, yeah, the miss was really annoying. The landers would have been dead, like... Yeah, that sucks. I mean, landers is not doing that much, but it's like an extra sack for Rory, which sucks. So yeah, um, Rory's landers is Scarf, in my opinion. Because he needs... It doesn't have to be Scarf, because he has the Sandwich X drill for some speed control and potential fake out. Like, Medicham should have fake out. I don't know if it has Bullet Punch, but it should have fake out for sure. But yeah, I don't know if, like... Excadrill plus fake out is enough speed control. I will still I would still think the landers is Scarf because like Specscalia plus Medicham already like break decently well. And Scarf Lander is just like a nice glue to end of the Make the team. I don't want to say flawless, but to round off the team. It would make sense to me. It could that it could also be offensive off played. Something along those lines. I don't think it would be defensive because he already has um, a defensive Tita probably. It's obviously defensive Tita that I still question nothing. I mean it was minus one but still. And he also has a Tango so that's kind of a defensive backbone already. That flinch, uh, that, that flinch didn't matter like... <laughs> the miss and Lana was annoying yeah. I mean he got a crit earlier on Tango but I don't think that mattered that much. So what's this land I'm gonna go for, Eugen? So it is helmet. Did Rodri already reveal that he's helmet landers? Yeah, I was talking like this is scarf, but like looking at his team, he's kind of weak to opposing sand besides the Tangler. So I guess it makes sense that he's defensive landers. I was just like super sure that he was scarf. So I guess Sandra's drill is enough with fake up this. Like on the team he expected GTM to bring. I guess there was enough speed control. I don't know, my bad. Like. This man is wild. He's in hot butter. Like, this guy's so wild. He could have just lost his manager in there, right? Okay, that dies. I mean, Laddie is weak, but it's not that weak. Um, If the helmet was already revealed and I was still like speculating it was Scarf Landers, that's my bad. Skafta hits an edge, Kelly just comes in here. I think get him I think get this money wins, yeah. Get this money should win this. Um yeah, I was talking about it earlier when he went from Tita into Landris trying to bait a low kick and to to get helmet damage plus sandstorm plus life up to kill the Wee Well, but for some reason I completely like blanked out and then thought it was Scarfland. I mean, it wasn't a huge mistake, I, like, unless the helmet was already revealed. Like, like I said, it makes sense that 
he's defensive because he's kind of weak to sand because his AV Tangrowth is not defensive Tangrowth. But yeah, I just thought Scarf would make sense for the nice speed control. Because I didn't pay attention if he's smooth rock. If he's smooth rock, I guess it's decent speed control. Because if you're not smooth rock, if you're not smooth rock, you only have five sandstorm turns. So like the sandstorm started turn six, and it's subsided turn eleven. So he's not. He's not. So head plus plus ice punch, like Medicham gets the recall, and Kelly just wins. So GG GGM is on. He's back. He's back. He won last week versus um Trusco, if I recall correctly, with Zard. Made like an aggressive play that worked out. Um Lefty said the amazing comeback, bros we in this. Let me check the score real quick. I mean I <laughs> he always has money garden when he wins. He's called get this money, it's like funny kind of. Mm. I mean I feel like I could have concent I was like drifting apart at the end. I could have concentrated more on the game there. Because I was like kind of annoyed by the fact that I didn't catch the lander set correct. Um, there was something else that I wanted to talk about that I forgot. I honestly don't remember it now, and I cannot pause it because it's obvious it's not it's not Camtasia. So let me just check the score. So uh, Lefty said nice comeback for his team, so pretty sure Lefty is under Falcons. Yeah, he is under Falcons. Lefty's lost versus ABR, missed that game. Scatter versus Jimmy Glader. Nice, I gotta record that even though, yeah, like I said, I didn't sleep. I'm gonna say it again. I stay up for you guys, for the content. Um, Yeah, GTM won, so the score is 4-4. Rodri was like 4 and though I think he lost twice in a row now. If I recall correctly. Like, I don't know if he lost last week. But if it was not last week, he lost the week before that. No, I think he lost last week and he was 4 0 before that. Um, thank you guys for watching. the. I think Nintendo is playing in 15 minutes. We can see which team he is on. Uh, he's playing for Aros OU. Why do I not see the team? He is on. Chill Shadow was Nintendo, so Wolfpack was his Tigers. I mean, Wolfpack, Chill Shadow has to win that for the Wolfpack if they want to make like a comeback to have a chance to make playoffs. Um, yeah, I am got hexed again yesterday. That sucked. I didn't record that, but he uploads that. He uploads his game, obviously. I yeah, thank you guys for watching. No reason to prolong this I'm gonna have to save my voice because there is like a lot more matches upcoming hope you enjoyed peace out friends stay tuned for more I'm repeating myself <laughs> goodbye <laughs>